Have you ever noticed how some people seem to pass content from one social media platform to the other seamlessly? And it might seem that opening and close, or that might have lots of tabs on a browser or anything else. And have you ever wondered how they actually might do things? Well, I'm going to show you how I use my iPad to uh, do things on social media and some of the applications I use. I don't particularly use... The, if you look at this, this is the basic iPad app for Twitter, which is very basic. I mean, we can just do a status update. Or we could, we've we got uh, options here to retweet, to reply to this tweet, um, retweet it, favourite it, or copy link to the tweet or mail the tweet. And that's if you just tap it. This is my stream. And I can do searches. I can uh, discover things like here and then look at my own profile so I'll close that down here is my favorite Twitter client I found out about this through somebody else it's Tweetbot and believe you me once you start using it you won't want to go back to anything else I think it is available on the iPhone and I'm just going to reply to this tweet. Right, let's take a look at a particular tweet, um, just this one here, just for instance, this quote. Now if you see on this menu here, I can reply to this tweet, I can retweet it, I can quote the tweet, I can retweet it to my followers, I can favourite it from here, I can share it, I can copy the link to the tweet, copy the tweet, email the tweet. And then I've got actions here. I can view the details. See which client they're using if I'm interested. I can look at the conversation. If there is one with anybody else. I can view the retweets. The other people. Which is quite useful because. You might be wanting to get ideas for content. To tweet and seeing how many people are retweeting that tweet I can translate it and I can view it in Favestar or Fabstar ok now also what you can do um, here's a tweet with a link I can share that and send it to Pocket. So, I'll send it to Pocket. And we'll close this down. And we'll go to Pocket. And here is that post in Pocket. Now, if I want to, I can share that to LinkedIn, Tumblr. 
I can copy the link to WordPress. I can share it to Facebook. I can open it in Google Chrome. I can do all sorts with it. Close that. Right. I like the Pin Interest app as well because let's just go to home. I'll just look for an image, um, a funny one, let's just say, one that we can use. Let's just see what we've got. Right, this one's not too bad. It's a bit small, but I'm just going to see if I can help. OK, well, what I can do with this... Oh, it's stuck. Damn. Oh, it's happening on the site that it's on. But there's a th thing at the top here where I can share it on Facebook, Twitter, or I can save it to the... Let's just... Uh, I'll save it to the camera roll, OK? Close that. Open up Tweetbot. And up here is where you go. I'm just composing the tweet. Choose from library. Camera roll. Tweet. And there we go. So from one platform to another, pin interest, without having to go to a website or anything. And there's my tweet. Also, um, you can do searches on this. So I've got some set up for social media. And then all of down here, it's just a matter of picking something which I think might be quite interesting. And then I can just retweet it. And there we go. Here's my favourites that I've... Um, kept. Here's lists that I can edit and everything. Here's the retweets of people that have retweeted me. So I can use this information if I want to, to find out which tweets are getting the most retweets, etc. And then we've got all the settings and everything. And that's it. Tweetbot is really a powerful piece of software. If you're not using it, I can highly recommend it. Another one I like to use is Google+. Plus. Now, I remember that picture I had that I got from Pinterest. Well, there's actually two, but I'm going to... There's one that I got from um, of Google+. Plus earlier. I'm going to share that. No, I've already done it. There we go. Just add some uh, something to it. There we go. So from going from one platform, Pinterest, Pinterest, sorry, and Twitter, 
and Google Plus, I've taken one piece of content from one platform and shared it on another platform and I'm going to share it on somewhere else if I can because sometimes I do you send stuff to Tumblr as well because I've just set up an account up on there. Gonna retweet that. Well, reblog it. Right, picture. And there we go. So I've took one image from one platform, Pinterest, and posted it to three places without having to do very much work at all. So you can probably see how powerful this is. For me, an iPad is a brilliant tool for doing your social media. I mean, uh, there's even Hootsuite on it. I don't use it that often, but if you're want to, if you a user of Hootsuite, then um, by all means do use it. Not that I use it that much, but there you go. So I hope you enjoyed... Um, quick tour of how I do things on social media. Thanks for watching and please uh, send this to your friends etc.